my name is kumar aditya and in this video i will talk about the characteristics of a tbs diode so here i am using a, a bidirectional tbs diode from little fuse this is uh, smcj 30 ca and this is unidirectional uh, uh, tbs diode from the little fuse itself so lt spice does not have separate symbol for unidirectional and bidirectional one can create one but here i am using the generic diode symbol for this unidirectional tvs diode now this diode is uh, rated for uh, breakdown voltage of 48 volt at peak pulse current rating of 31 amp and uh, breakdown voltage minimum breakdown voltage is 33 volt and maximum breakdown voltage is 36 volt at the test current of 1 milli amp so usually maximum breakdown voltage is also called as the clamping voltage because you know this breakdown voltage is defined for some a specific test current but this diode also has some peak pulse current rating so what will be the voltage when that peak pulse current is allowed to flow through the diode defines the clamping voltage of the diode now this is this also has the similar rating uh, it has the minimum breakdown voltage of 36 and maximum of 40 at the test current of 1 milliamp and it has clamping voltage of 53.3 volt at peak pulse current rating of 28.2 amp so here i am trying to plot the iv characteristics like it has been shown in the data sheet now this is not specific to this diode these are generic iv characteristic and uh, to plot the iv characteristic i am performing a sweep on this uh, dc voltage source v1 so i am sweeping this v1 from minus 50 to 50 volt in the increment of 0.01 volt and if i run the simulation if i run the simulation this is the plot i get so green one is for the unidirectional tbs this is for unidirectional tbs and this is for bidirectional bidirectional tbs diode so from the curve itself you can understand that uh, the unidirectional tvs diode will behave like a, a normal diode when forward biased so it has certain forward voltage drop at which it start conducting however when reversed bias it will not conduct until the voltage applied uh, exceeds its breakdown limit in bidirectional you have you have dead zone in both the positive and the neg negative direction that it even when forward bias it will not conduct until the voltage applied exceeds its breakdown voltage limit and uh, in reverse direction as well it will not conduct until voltage applied exceeds the breakdown voltage of the tvs diode so let's put a cursor to see at what voltage the breakdown occur so for the red one by directional one the breakdown occur at 35.7 volt and current is 47 milliamp this is very close to uh, data sheet so you see in the data sheet breakdown occur at uh, minimum breakdown voltage 33 volt at 1 milliamp and uh, obviously the cursor cursor is not placed uh, at exact breakdown voltage so you will not get the current rating matching this 1 milliamp also it may be, it may be possible that the lt spice model is not very accurate to match the data sheet parameter but the idea here is to show you what is the difference between the unidirectional tvs diode and bidirectional tvs diode and how you can plot the iv characteristic of such diode i hope this is useful to you in some way one thing i would like to point out that tvs diode are not meant for voltage regulation these are not gener diode so tvs diode are usually placed directly across the supply to absorb the voltage transient and due to est or some noise but gener diode are used for precise voltage regulation so that's one basic difference between tvs and gener diode i hope this may be useful to you in some way bye bye